It was a calm yet peaceful day on the island of Sodor. At Marin Station, Diesel was about to make his way to Vickerstown with a small goods train destined for the mainland. Automotive parts, cars, and other things were, were part of the consist. Diesel was very eager to start. At that moment, Diesel's driver arrived back from the station uh, rooftop to collect the manifest. He was excited. Come on, Diesel. Let's not waste time. We must get there at once. At that moment, the signal turned to green, and Devious Diesel, or formerly Devious Diesel, made his way. Endeavorous Diesel made his way. The cars didn't complain, but they decided to play some tricks. They soon made up to the reverse top of Henry's Hill. Diesel slowed, decided to slow down. We're stopping Diesel, said the driver. But at that moment, the truck surged against Diesel and banged into the back of him. He became a runaway. Diesel surged down Gordon's Hill without any, any notice. He was terrified. The alarm rang down the line as word got down the line. The signalman was frantic. Stop the runaway, he said. At, Mer at, 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 at Crosby Station, Sheffield was about to make way when he suddenly... That's Diesel, said Sheffield. We gotta get out of here. Come on, old boy, let's go. And Sheffield's crew jumped into their engine and they popped just beyond the platform with pastors and coaches in tow. They switched the points for Diesel to be a runaway siding. Diesel saw what was in front of him. Oh dear, said the driver, we got to get out of here. They were soon switching to the siding where the barber set up shop. Fortunately this time, he was, there were no customers to shave. Luckily no one was hurt, but a dreadful draft came through the building. Some of the cars derailed behind Diesel, and thankfully none of the good stock was damaged. Diesel felt embarrassed. Thankfully his driver jumped clear before the crash. There was a lot of confusion and delay. Are you alright, Diesel? said Sheffield, who called out from behind. I think he might be injured, said the driver's and fireman's. Let's go get some help. The passengers were badly shaken, and the coaches were very terrified. It was rever very reminiscent of Duck's accident many, many years ago. Don't you worry, I just called and an engine with the breakdown train will be coming its way, said the signalman, so stay tight. Good that you're here. Now let's pull Diesel out of this shop before the barber becomes angry. The engine arrived with the breakdown train and slowly pulled Diesel out of the barber shop. Diesel was surprised. He didn't imagine this happening to him. Diesel, I am surprised you decided to go for a shave. <laughs> now, it's ironic that I sent you away and duck out this accident many years ago. <laughs> what a coincidence, Diesel. <laughs> a shave for a Diesel, no less. <laughs> well, said, Be said uh, Sheffield, I am surprised. <laughs> Seems you are having a quite a time there, Diesel. And Sheffield made his way with his coaches and the trucks that Diesel was taking, as Diesel was badly damaged from the accident. Mm -hmm. 
Diesel had a lot to think about of his funny incident with the barbershop. That, indeed. <laughs>